I've got some good news for you. If you have the right mindset, you're going to be able to handle anything that comes at you. But you've got to have that right mindset. And that's what we're going to cover on this episode of Stark Raving Entrepreneurs. Welcome to Stark Raving Entrepreneurs, where you discover how to achieve your goals and dreams, getting the freedom you want, all while living voluntarily, peacefully, and with a live and let live lifestyle. Hi, I'm Terry Brock, and welcome to this episode of Stark Raving Entrepreneurs, where I'm going to talk with you about a mindset that can be really helpful to you. This is what we do. We think the mindset is most important for entrepreneurs and really for everyone else, too. And we talk about a live and let live style. That's what we talk about, where you do what you want to do and you let others do what they want to do. The key is you do whatever you want, whenever you want, as long as you take responsibility for what you do and you don't harm another. We call it the non-aggression principle. You don't initiate aggression against someone else. When you do that, you're going to be fine. And there's a way of thinking that can help you a lot. Matter of fact, today is a good day. Look, I'm here outside right now here in Orlando. Look at this. It's raining. It's a cloudy day. And you look around and go over the lake there. And a lot of people would say, oh, no, it's raining. It's a bad day. Well, I would say I understand where they're coming from on that. But I would uh, beg to differ that when you have something going on in the world, it's up to you to decide what you're going to do. I look at it right now, the temperature is actually kind of cool right now, which is good here in Orlando. We like that. The air is very fresh. And yes, it's raining a light drizzle there, but I'm not getting wet at all. I'm standing out here on the balcony right now, and I'm getting a lot of uh, free negative ions coming my way. They call them negative, but I think they're really positive. But it's the negative ions that make the air so clean. Fresh, clean air. It's cool, which is nice, and it's something that is refreshing and rejuvenating. I'd say that's a good thing. But others could say, oh, no, it's raining, it's bad. And you see, the key is it's up to you. You get to decide. This is a key principle to help you get ahead in life. It really is up to you how you're going to interpret it. Are you, interpret, are you interpreting it as it's a bad thing or as a good thing? This is a philosophy that has been around for a long time. I really enjoy it. It's from my, uh, three of my buddies, Marcus Aurelius, Epictetus, and uh, Seneca. These were three people that were some of the more well-known Stoics of that day. And i got to say a big shout-out and a thank you to Ryan Holiday for his book on the Daily Stoic. I'm reading that every day. Love it. And the other works he's done as well. You get a chance to read some good books by Ryan Holiday. I highly recommend that. But this philosophy says you get to control. 99% of what happens is out of your control, really. The things that are happening to you. You do, however, get to control how you're going to react always. You can't control what happens to you most of the time. Particularly good way to look at this is with politics. I know we're in the year of midterms here in the United States as I'm recording this, and people are all hot and bothered about this candidate or that candidate. Is it this one or is that one? And people really get upset about it. But think about it. It's not up to you, and you don't have any control over what the knuckleheads in Washington, D.C. are going to do, or in Ottawa, or in Tokyo, or in Canberra there in Australia, or in London, or in Moscow. All the capitals around the world, all the people that are politicians, you can't control them. You can control whether you're going to get upset or decide, hey, they did this, the logical ramifications of that happening are this, this, and this, therefore I am going to do this that will align it with my goals. As an entrepreneur, you can do that. As a stark raving entrepreneur that you are watching this, you get a chance to attack it in the way that's going to be peaceful and help others as well. And that's the, the beauty of it, and that's the joy. It's up to you and the things that matter most, how you're going to feel, what you're going to do, what you do with your body, that is up to you. And you can find ways. Now, are there times that you're constrained? Hey, yeah. I think of Viktor Frankl, who was a psychiatrist that was kidnapped by the Nazis in World War II, thrown into Auschwitz. I think he was in Auschwitz and Dachau. And he saw what was going on. He lost all his family. Many, many of his friends were lost. And so he wrote a book about the whole experience, Man's Search for Meaning. A very good book that I'd highly recommend reading. And he said, everything can be taken from you except your decision of how you're going to react. So on a day like today, 
you get to decide, is this a good day? For me, I'm saying, yeah, it is. <laughs> this is a good day because it's fresh and clean. And another nice thing about it, we're heading into it's late afternoon as I'm recording this, and we're going to have the evening come. It's clean air. The breeze will come in, and Gina and I are going to get a chance to just sit and relax and watch some good videos tonight and enjoy that learning and growing. So it's up to you. I encourage you to embrace that way of thinking. Look at what's available. And by the way, come over and join us with Stark Raving Entrepreneurs. We have StarkRavingEvent.com. You can register there and come every Wednesday. We have a free program you can come to. Here's some really valuable information to help you as an entrepreneur. Hang around with some other uh, fellow entrepreneurs and see what it's like. And if you say, hey, we like that, we want a little more, we have other programs where you can get even more benefit uh, for a charge. You're able to get some things for very, very low investment. We keep it really low so that a lot of people can get in and be able to benefit from that. So we'd love you to check that out. I look forward to hearing from you. Let me know what you think. And matter of fact, let's keep the idea of a positive way of looking at life and you controlling your life and the communities that we serve. I have little flies flying around there by me, uh, but that's okay. I can swap the fly away and it's gone. <laughs> but what we can do is we can control what we're going to do. Share this with your community. Our world needs this message. And that way it'll let the bots know, the algorithms that are watching this, hey, people like live and let live. And that's really important. So thank you very much for joining me. I will look forward to hearing from you and hope you have a wonderful day controlling your life and making decisions of what you are going to do. Hey, don't stop now. We've got a lot more videos out there for you about freedom and liberty, living the life of an entrepreneur who believes in live and let live. As a matter of fact, here's a way you can make a positive difference in the world. Like this video, subscribe to the channel. That lets the algorithms know, those wacky algorithms know, that hey, people like this kind of thing of live and let live and doing it in a peaceful way. Thanks for being here with us and we're looking forward to hearing from you.